news today EBA Ethiopian Broadcasting Authority suspended the press license of writers correspondent in Ethiopia writers correspondent who was covering Tigray conflict his press license has been suspended by EBA EBA issued a statement the statement says that the reporting on Tigray conflict uh, being done by uh, Reuters correspondent was biased and false and EBA first issued warning letter and after that it has now decided to suspend the press license of Reuters correspondent. Further viewers, uh, EBA issued warning letters to the correspondents of BBC and DWTV as well. So all international news channels, they are under fire from EBA, Ethiopian Broadcasting Authority viewers. Reuters did some stories on ethnic profiling being done by Ethiopian government in the past few days. Two stories were done viewers. In the first story, Reuters mentioned the visit of Ethiopian police uh, of uh, uh, an office of WFP, World Food Program, and Ethiopian police there demanded, requested the list of ethnic Tigrayans who were part of the staff of WFP. Then viewers, a second story was done by Reuters regarding disarming of uh, ethnic Tigrayans who were part of peacekeeping contingent in Somalia. Uh, so two stories were done by writers in the past few days regarding ethnic profiling being done by Ethiopian government. Uh, now viewers, uh, Ethiopian government has decided to suspend the license of uh, Reuters correspondent. Uh, viewers, this development shows that things are not going as were planned were by Ethiopian government. They are finding it difficult to answer uh, the questions being raised by international media, especially about ethnic profiling. That is why perhaps this move has been uh, decided to suspend the license of uh, Reuters correspondent viewers. Uh, thank you for watching.